Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Creating a class diagram in Eclipse involves using a combination of the Eclipse IDE and a modeling tool. Eclipse itself does not have built-in support for UML diagrams, but you can achieve this by using plugins such as Papyrus, ObjectAid, or UML Designer. Below, I will provide a tutorial on how to create a class diagram using the ObjectAid UML Explorer plugin, along with a simple Java code example. Hashtag 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 tutorial, creating a Java class diagram in Eclipse using ObjectAid. Hashtag 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 step 1, install Eclipse. 1. Download and install Eclipse, if you haven't already, download and install the Eclipse IDE for Java developers from the Eclipse website, https colon slash slash www.eclipse.org slash downloads. Hashtag 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 step 2, install Objectate UML Explorer plugin. 1. Open Eclipse. 2. Go to Help Eclipse Marketplace. 3. Search for ObjectAid. 4. Find ObjectAid UML Explorer and click Go. 5. Click Install and follow the installation instructions. Restart Eclipse when prompted. Hashtag 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 Step 3, Create a New Java Project. 1. Go to File New Java Project. 2. Enter a name for your project, example class diagram example. 3. Click finish. Hashtag 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 step 4, create Java classes. For this example, we will create two simple Java classes, person and student. 1. Create a new package. Right click on src new package. Name it com example. 2. Create the person class. Right click on the package you created, com example, new class. Name it person and click finish. Add the following code to person.java. 3. Create the student class. Right click on the package, com example, new class. Name it student and click finish. Add the following code to student.java. Hashtag 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 step 5, create a class diagram. 1. Right click on the project, or in the package explorer, new other. 2. Expand the object aid folder and select class diagram. Click next. 3. Enter a name for your diagram, example class diagram, and click finish. 4. You will see a blank diagram canvas. Hashtag 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 step 6, add classes to the diagram. 1. Open the class diagram you just created by double clicking it. 2. In the package explorer, find the person and student classes. 3. Drag and drop the person and student classes onto the diagram canvas. Hashtag 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 step 7, configure relationships. 1. Select the student class in the diagram. 2. Use the arrow tool from the toolbar to create a relationship, inheritance, from student to person. 3. You should see an arrow indicating that student extends person. Hashtag 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 step 8, customize your diagram. You can resize the classes, change colors, and add notes. You can also add attributes and methods directly in the diagram. Hashtag 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 step 9, export your diagram. 1. Right click on the diagram in the package explorer. 2. Select export and choose the format you prefer, example PNG, JPEG, etc. 3. Follow the prompts to save your diagram. Hashtag 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 conclusion. You've successfully created a Java class diagram using Eclipse and the ObjectAid plugin. This diagram visually represents the classes and their relationships, which can be helpful for documentation and understanding the architecture of your application. Hashtag 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 additional resources. Eclipse ObjectAid documentation, 
http colon slash slash www.objectate.com UML class diagrams on Wikipedia https colon slash slash en dot wikipedia dot org slash wiki slash class underscore diagram feel free to explore other plugins or tools for uml diagrams based on your needs